Angela E. Shambly with the English 101 minute or two or three or four. Today we're talking about narration. All right, what constitutes a story that you write? Well, usually a story's got to have character. You know it's got to have character. Story's got to have conflict. You know, and there's three kinds of basic conflict. A, um, you know, physical. If you get mad on <coughs> somebody, physical. You got inner conflict. You know this um, commercial. I don't even know what this sound on the commercial. But this guy walks up to this guy, gives him a briefcase. This guy, uh, $100,000 and a whole lot of money in. And, and, and the he just leaves for a few minutes and says, will you watch this for me, you know? And so the brother's sitting there, and you can see what's going on in the brother's mind. He's thinking, suppose they think I stole this money. Suppose somebody comes up and they take it away from me. What am I going to do? How did I get myself into this? All right. He has anxiety. That's called inner conflict. All right. Trying to make an important decision. You got anxiety. Alright, the third kind of conflict you have. Verbal conflict. People are having an argument and they're screaming and yelling and cursing at each other. Verbal conflict. Alright, I think that's going to be it for now. Ciao.